everyone and welcome back to when i'm robber and today's video i'm gonna show you how to loot the jewelry store heist stealthily using c4 and a lockpick and no we won't be using a gun or we won't be masking up so without further ado let's get this one started when we first start this heist what you want to do is grab your duffel bag place two c4 in it and grab your lockpick and from the truck you want to head to the front of the jewelry store once we get to the front of the jewelry store what we want to do is hang a right go right through these next two doors take out our lockpick and lock this door to the vault area next we want to take our lockpick go up these stairs and at the top of the staircase we unlock this door after unlocking this door you want to come over here we're going to unlock this door for future reference but we're not going to go through it just yet leave our lockpick right next to the door go through this door grab the utility key card off the desk and head back downstairs once we get downstairs we're going to close this door Take our utility key card, open up this door, make sure the camera's not looking. If it is, we're gonna wait till it turns. Once it turns, we're gonna hide underneath it and we're gonna wait for it to turn again so we can go over to the utility room and disable the alarm. Once it turns, head over to the utility room, scan the card and turn off the alarm. Hide underneath the camera once again and wait for it to turn. Head back through here, close this door. And now the next step, we're gonna run through this door which is gonna trigger the guard from upstairs outside the manager's office to come down to investigate we're gonna get caught on the staircase, but we're gonna use the C4 to explode him. So just like so, run through the door, meet the guard on the staircase. If we get caught, it doesn't matter. Place it right there. He'll blow up, grab his phone, and do the check-in in the utility room. Close this door. Take this guard's body and we're gonna drag it into the break room upstairs. After doing so, we're gonna go through this door and we're gonna unlock the door to the manager's office and we're gonna unlock the door to the security room. Now for the next step, we're gonna use a C4 to take out the guard that's watching the cameras so we don't have to worry about cameras throughout the rest of the heist. So we're gonna head back downstairs, take our lock pick and place it back in our duffel bag like so. Take our other C4 and we're gonna head back upstairs. Now, before we do this, what I recommend doing is leaving our C4 right here, go into the manager's office, and since we're not masked up, he won't freak out when we go in here. We're gonna push the manager away from this wall just to be safe so he doesn't get caught up in the splash damage. We're gonna take the C4 and we're gonna place it right beside this plant just to be safe. Wait for it to explode. He's gonna take out the guard. We're gonna take his phone, do the check-in in the break room. Now that's going to alert the guard in the alleyway, so what we're going to do is just drag this guard's body into the corner, like so. Now all we got to do is just wait for the guard to come up, complete his investigation, and go back downstairs. And once he passes by yet again, we're going to sneak in right behind him, go through the manager's office. We're going to grab the vault key card off the manager's desk, head back downstairs. Place it in our duffel bag, pick up our duffel bag. Now that we killed that guard in the security room, we don't have to worry about the cameras. We'll take the vault key card, scan the vault, and after we open up the vault door, we have one more door to unlock with our lockpick. And after we're done with that, we don't have to use the lockpick anymore, and we can take our duffel bag, and now we can loot the entire vault area. And the route that we'll take to get back to the truck is very simple. We'll go out the same doors that we just came through, sprint through this door, go out the front door, and head back to the truck, rinse and repeat until we have all the loot from the vault area. And just to re-enter, just enter through the front, go through the side doors when no one's looking, and we're back in the vault area. Also, don't forget this watch that's on the desk over here outside the vault area. And once we have all the loot, we can take it back to the truck and end the heist. And this was how to loot the jewelry store heist stealthily using C4. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe to help the channel grow. If you wanna see a funny video, click the video on the left. If you wanna see more tutorial videos, click the video on the right. And like always, I hope you have a fantastic day and I'll see you in the next video.